Spider-Man, Spider-Man, I once called Green Goblin Glider-Man. Yep. Alright, here I am doing this Spider-Man uh, mini-painting. This is a study for a final painting that I will probably have up uh, soon. Who knows? And a little bit. Uh, I'd say about two weeks from now. But, yeah, so essentially, uh, this is, uh, I think it's four by six inches, so it's very small. Uh, I was just working, I just wanted to kind of get a composition together. This is generally going to be the, uh, what the final is going to look like, uh, but, yeah, I just wanted to kind of throw something together, see what I wanted to do, and uh, see if I can make it work, see if I can, see if I, I liked what, what I came up with, and uh, for the most part, I do like the the composition I have here oh that dreaded ding I'm gonna mm, I'm gonna murder that ding if you can murder a ding I know you can murder the beat but can you murder the ding who knows we'll figure that out <laughs> but um, yeah so I'm working with a super teeny tiny miniature uh, paintbrush like this paintbrush is smaller than it's basically four of your nose hairs put together. Like that one episode of SpongeBob when he paints Mr. Krabs' walls with his one nose hair. That's essentially the paintbrush I'm using right now. <laughs> but um, but yeah, so in this painting we have here in the my, in the foreground, if, you, if you're if you not the biggest uh, Spider-Man fan or if you don't know the entire the entirety of the, the characters and side characters and villains and all that all that jazz, then I will explain that to you now. So, the person we have in the foreground here in the bottom left of the canvas would be uh, Dr. Octopus, a.k.a. Doc Ock. And if you say that real quick, it sounds kind of silly. But, yeah. <laughs> and then uh, he's squaring off uh, at the top of this roof against Spider-Man here. Spider-Man in one of his uh, iconic poses, being all spidery and, and stuff. Although, he only has four arms, and Dr. Octopus has, well, not arms, but he's got these... Uh, mechanical tentacles, and then he's got four human appendages. So I guess he's kind of an octopus in, to a certain extent, metaphorically. I guess he's like he's got eight. There's eight eight things. Get out of here, pen. There's eight. Where with Spider-Man, he just acts. He has he has the qualities of a spider, but he doesn't actually have eight ligaments, uh, appendages, whatever. Anyway, flying in from behind, if you can even make that out yet, uh, in the very middle, above Spider-Man, above this uh, the building right here, oh, what I'm working on right now, is uh, the Green Goblin, probably one of the most most widely known Spider-Man villains, I'd say. I'd, it'd probably be somewhere between him and probably Dr. Octopus, or Sandman, or, I don't know, there's so many Spider-Man villains, I could go on for days. Yeah, so that's Green Goblin, a.k.a. Norman Osborn. Spoilers. Played by Willem Dafoe in the 2002 Tommy Maguire rendition of the film, I think he captured the essence of the Green Goblin so well in this film. He was just so eerie and mysterious and menacing and insane. It was great, but I would have liked so much more if they stayed closer to the costume from the comic book as opposed to that weird suit that they made, but it's probably copyright issues or, you know, something. But that's how the movie industry works. <sighs> Hollywood. Yeah, so essentially, um, so yeah, we got Green Goblin, he's throwing in one of his little pumpkin bombs on uh, Spidey. Spidey knows it, he knows it's coming, he's got his Spidey senses tingling, I just signed my name and then keep working on it, that's a thing I, classic thing for me, I'll sign my name and then I'll just keep working on it, because... I think it's done, but then all of a sudden I look back at it and, and I think, no, no, it's not done, not yet. But uh, here's the final product. You can see, look at those. Yeah, you can see how small this is just by seeing that zoomed in. But, but yeah, so this is going to be, um, this is just a study for the for the big one. So planning on doing that fairly soon. Um, hope you all enjoyed and have an awesome time. Living. Okay, bye.